Hey guys, today we have two sets of jungle animals. These are really nice looking sets. Each of them has three jungle animals and they're kind of cartoony. So they're really cool with really big features. These are just some of the animals that we would meet in the jungle. Jungle animals. All right, let's open them up and learn a little bit more about each animal. Alrighty. All right, now let's learn a little bit more about each animal. First we have the elephant. The elephants are a family of pachyderms and there are two species, the African elephant and the Asian elephant. The African elephant is actually two different species. One was the African bush elephant and the African forest elephant. And the Asian elephant is also known as the Indian elephant. Elephants are mammals and they're the largest land animals alive today. Elephants are symbols of wisdom in Asian cultures and are famed for their exceptional memory and high intelligence. The word elephant comes via Latin from Greek for ivory. Now here's some fun facts. Jumbo was a circus elephant and his name came into the English language to mean large. Now elephants are herbivores. They spend 16 hours a day collecting plant food. They eat 50% grasses with leaves, bamboo, twigs, bark, roots, and small amounts of fruit, seeds, and flowers. When they walk at a normal pace, they can cover about two to four miles an hour, but they can reach 24 miles an hour at full speed. Both the male and female African elephants have large tusks that can reach over 10 feet and weigh over 200 pounds. Thank you, Mr. Elephant. <coughs> this is the cheetah. The cheetah is sometimes mistaken for a leopard, but it's a leaner animal with longer legs. The cheetah lives in the grasslands, areas of dense vegetation, open plains, and mountain terrains in Africa and Iran. They live alone or in small groups. The females live alone, except when they have cubs. Usually they bear three to five cubs, weighing between nine and 15 ounces when born. The mother cheetah moves her cubs into new hiding places every few days to keep them safe. Now cheetahs are a carnivore. They eat rabbits, birds, gazelles, wildebeest, impalas, ostriches, and antelope. They hide in the tall grasses and stalk their prey. Then they suddenly race out and attack. The cheetah is the fastest animal on land and can reach speeds of 70 miles an hour, yet can only run 400 to 600 yards before it's exhausted. The name cheetah comes from a Hindi word meaning spotted one, and they are the only big cat that purrs. They don't even roar. Thanks, Cheetah. This guy here is, of course, a giraffe.
The giraffe is the tallest living animal and can reach vegetation that other herbivores can't. They eat grass, leaves, shrubs, and fruit, and they don't really need a lot of water. A giraffe browses around most of the day, eating anywhere from 15 to 65 pounds of food. At night, though, they can lay down and rest. Giraffes live in Africa in arid and dry savanna areas where trees occur. They live in loose herds with no specific leaders. Their height make it easier to spot predators from a distance. So if one signals danger, they all run. When giraffes walk, they move both right legs forward, then both left. But when they're running, the back legs come forward on the outside of the front legs. Now the baby giraffes are born with a mother standing, so they fall to the ground at birth. Giraffes were once thought to be a cross between a camel and a leopard, and that's how they got their name. Thanks, giraffe. This is the tiger. Tigers are the biggest cat and they live in Asia. And there are several species, including Indian, Chinese, Malayan, and Sumatran. Tigers prefer to eat hoofed animals, such as deer, buffalo, pigs, cattle, although they will eat monkey, birds, rabbit, and fish. Tigers like the water and will cool off in the river. And they're also really good swimmers. A group of tigers is called a streak, although they're usually solitary animals, except for raising their cubs. And a female tiger is grown up at three years old, where the males are usually aren't completely grown until four. A tiger can eat 60 pounds of meat in a single night. The Amur tiger is the largest of the species, while the Sumatran tiger is the smallest. And the National Tiger Day is the last Sunday of September. Thanks, tiger. Now this guy is a zebra. Zebras are hoofed animals and they belong to the horse family. Zebras have excellent eyesight and hearing. The three main species of zebra are plain zebra, mountain zebra, and grevy zebra. The plain zebra is the most common type and they're widespread. The different species of zebras also have different types of stripes. Some have V-shaped patterns, some have narrow stripes in the front that get wider in the back, and some have one long stripe that runs along their back with a white belly. Not only can you tell what type of zebra it is by its stripes, but no zebra has exactly the same stripes. Zebras can run up to 40 miles per hour, and baby zebras can run an hour after they're born. In ancient Rome, the Grevy zebras were called hippogrits and trained to pull carts for the circus. On the Serengeti Plains, the Burchell zebras sometimes form migratory herds of tens of thousands. Thanks, zebra. <laughs> now this is the lion. The lion is the only big cat that lives in social groups. These groups are called prides and they're usually from 3 to 30 lions. The female lions are often related and they share the care of the cubs, while the lionesses do the majority of the hunting. Now even though they do very little of the hunting, the males eat first, followed by the females, then the cubs. When they're fully grown, the male lions leave the pride and search for another pride to join. They fight the older, injured males to become part of the new pride. The loser has to leave. Now there are two surviving species of lion, the African and the Asian. Lions live in grassy plains, savannas, open woodlands, dense bush, and scrubland. The size of their territories is dependent on the size of their pride and the availability of their prey. The male's job is to patrol, mark, and guard the territory. They drive off other males and, of course, mate with the females. 
Lions eat medium and large herd animals from antelope, zebra, giraffe, baby elephants, rhinos, and buffalo. But they'll also eat rodents, reptiles, insects, and crocodiles. The male lion begins to grow their manes at about 18 months old, and they continue to grow until they're five. In Swahili, the word for lion is Simba. It also means king, strong, and aggressive. The lionesses are more agile and faster than the male lions, but both male and female lions roar. Lions lie around for 21 hours a day, and they can go five to six days without drinking. Thanks, lion. Wow. Ooh, thanks. Well, thanks for joining me today, guys. These are the jungle animals. We opened up two packs of three and got to learn a little bit more about each of them. You can go check out lots more cool things about each animal and meet some of the other jungle animals from Africa to Asia and all places in between. So thanks again for watching and we look forward to more great toy testing and lots more interesting animals on Toy Tester Tom. See you later.